Interference detection is an evaluation tool that has been used for many years to identify assembly components that are intersecting with one another, potentially resulting in manufacturing or assembly issues. Similarly, Large Design Review, or LDR, is a performance mode that has been used for many years to open extremely large assemblies very quickly, but with a reduced set of capabilities. And as a result, interference detection has never been available in Large Design Review mode, until now. So let's take a look at the use cases and limitations for interference detection in LDR mode in SOLIDWORKS 2025. First things first, you'll need to select Large Design Review mode before opening an assembly to reap the benefits of a quick open time. To do this, use the available mode slider that appears when an assembly file is selected in the Open command and set it to Large Design Review. Then just click Open as you normally would. A pop-up window will likely appear listing the capabilities of Large Design Review mode. Click OK to dismiss this pop-up and the assembly should open in just a few seconds. A handful of tools are available in the single Large Design Review tab that appears in the Command Manager, but you won't find interference detection here by default. To use it, navigate to the Tools drop-down, then Evaluate, and select Interference Detection from the list. For faster access in the future, consider doing a command search for interference detection and dragging the result onto the Command Manager to create a shortcut icon. Upon running interference detection, a dialog will appear letting you know that results will be approximate. Click OK to dismiss this warning and the tool will be ready to go. Individual components can be selected from the graphics area or the design tree, and the design tree can also be used to select sub-assemblies or the top-level assembly. Then select any options you wish to use and click Calculate to run the analysis, keeping in mind that running interference detection on a top-level assembly with many components can still take quite a bit of time, even in LDR mode. Results should still appear relatively quickly though, and you'll notice that interfering components are listed as surface intersections rather than the volumetric interference that would be calculated for a fully resolved assembly. This makes interference detection in LDR mode a great first pass analysis to quickly identify areas that may require further investigation in resolved mode, but it won't necessarily give you definitive results. Using interference detection in large design review mode is an excellent way to quickly evaluate thousands of components at once for potential manufacturing and fitment problems, and should be one of the first steps in the review process for large assemblies. So what do you think? Is this your favorite enhancement of the year? Let us know in the comments, and if you found this video useful, do us a big favor and give it a like so other SOLIDWORKS users can find it too. If you're looking to learn more about what's new in SOLIDWORKS 2025, consider subscribing to the channel for our latest releases, or visit our full What's New series available now at solidprofessor.com. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.